Let us have some questions from Earth's magnetic field and uh, let's have some brief uh, answers to those questions uh, that are linked with the, uh, with the magnetic field of Earth. And, and to start with, uh, the very first important question is, what is Earth's magnetic field? Uh, to answer this question, uh, Earth's magnetic field is a protective shield that, that surrounds the planet and extends uh, into space. It is generated by the movement of molten iron uh, in the outer core of Earth. The next important question is, what is the purpose of Earth's magnetic field? Now, Earth's magnetic field, uh, it serves several purposes, including protecting the planet from harmful solar radiations, uh, aiding in navigation and influencing the, the behavior of compost needles. The next important question is, how is Earth's magnetic field generated? Now, Earth's magnetic field is generated by, by the motion of molten iron in the, in the outer core. Uh, this, this motion creates electric currents, which in turn generates uh, a magnetic field. Now, what causes Earth's magnetic field to change over time? Now, to answer this question, Earth's magnetic field is a dynamic and can change over geological time scales. Now these changes uh, are known as geomagnetic reversals, involve a reversal of the magnetic poles. Now what is the difference between magnetic north and true north, right? The magnetic north is in the direction a compass points to, aligning with the Earth's magnetic field. True north is the geographic north pole, uh, which is located slightly offset from the magnetic north due to the Earth's magnetic field. Now, how often do geomagnetic reversals occur, which I talked about earlier? Now, geomagnetic reversals are irregular and can occur at intervals ranging from hundreds of thousands to millions of years. The last reversal uh, that occurred nearly 780,000 years ago. Now, what is the, the magnetosphere and how does it relate to the Earth's magnetic field? The magnetosphere is the region around the Earth influenced by the uh, planet's magnetic field. It protects the Earth from, from the solar wind a stream of charged particles emitted by the sun. Now, what is the solar, sin, uh, solar wind, I mean, and how does it interact with Earth's magnetic field? The, the solar wind, it, it's a continuous flow of charged particles, mainly electrons and protons, emitted by the sun. When it reaches Earth, it interacts with the magnetosphere, creating phenomena like or, uh, or auroras. Right? So, what causes these uh, auroras and, and what are they typically, uh, how, where are they typically seen basically? Now these auroras are also known as northern and southern lights, are caused by charged particles from solar wind, colliding with gases in Earth's atmosphere such as nitrogen and oxygen. They are typically seen in high latitude regions near poles. How, how do scientists study Earth's magnetic field? Uh, to answer this question, scientists study Earth's magnetic field using instruments like a uh, magnetometer, which measures the strength and, and direction of magnetic field at various locations on the planet. Satellites equipped with magnetometers provide a global view of magnetic field. Now, what are magnetic anomalies and, and how do they help in studying Earth's interior? Now, magnetic anomalies are, are variations in Earth's magnetic field strength. Uh, they can be caused by variation in the composition or, or variation in temperature of rocks in the Earth's crust and, and the upper mantle. These anom anomalies help scientists understand the structure of Earth's interior. Now, can changes in Earth's magnetic field affect technology and navigation? The answer has to be yes. Changes in Earth's magnetic field can affect compass reading, navigation systems that rely on magnetic data. However, modern technology has ways to compensate for, for, for these, these changes. Uh, 
how does Earth's magnetic field protect the planet from harmful uh, solar radiations as we talked about electrons and protons? Now this Earth's magnetic field deflects the charged particles from the Sun such as solar wind and solar flares away from the Earth's surface. This protective shield prevents these particles from, from reaching and, and damaging the planet's atmosphere uh, and the overall biological life. Uh, so, uh, how are, uh, are there any health effects associated with Earth's magnetic field? Uh, Earth's magnetic field is uh, relatively weak uh, and its effects on human uh, are not well understood. Uh, some studies have explored potential links between the magnetic field exposure and, and health tissues, but uh, there is no conclusive uh, evidence uh, in this case. Now, how does Earth's magnetic field influence animals' behavior, particularly migration? Some animals like birds and sea turtles are believed to use Earth's magnetic field for navigation during migration. They may have tiny magnetic particles in their bodies that align with Earth's magnetic field, uh, field lines. <clears throat> Is Earth's magnetic field constant over time and location? Earth's magnetic field varies in strength and direction over time and location. It's influenced by changes in Earth's core and, and can also be uh, uh, affected by external factors like solar activity. Now, what is the magnetic declination and why is it Im important for navigation? Now, this magnetic declination uh, is the angle between the true north and, uh, and, and the magnetic north. Uh, it is essential for accurate navigation as it helps uh, correct uh, for, for, for difference between the mag magnetic and true direction. Now, how do, how do scientists uh, study ancient magnetic field changes preserved in rocks? Now, to answer this question, scientists can study ancient magnetic field changes by examining the alignment of magnetic minerals in rocks. When rocks form, magnetic minerals align themselves with the Earth's magnetic field, preserving a record of its past direction. Could a geomagnetic reversal have significant, on, uh, significant effects on, on Earth's ecosystem or climate? Uh, I mean, uh, while geomagnetic reversals can cause some disruptions such as changes in radiation exposure, uh, they are not believed to have catastrophic uh, effects on Earth's ecosystem or climate. Uh, life on Earth has survived many uh, magnetic reversals in the past. Now, what are some ongoing scientific questions and mysteries surrounding Earth's magnetic field? We understand very less about uh, the magnetic field of Earth. So, so ongoing research aims to, to understand the mechanism behind the geomagnetic reversals, the interactions between Earth's magnetic field and solar activity, and the potential impact on long-term changes in magnetic field on our planet. Okay, so, so these were uh, some of the, the basic questions uh, that, 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 could, uh, uh, that could arise in, in our minds and, and, and I have figured out uh, the, the, the simplest answers to those basic questions that are linked with, with the magnetic field of Earth. And, and, and to, to be precise here, uh, to, to, be, uh, to be quite uh, accurate here, I would like to tell you that, that whatever we understand uh, uh, regarding the magnet magnetism associated with, with this planet, we understand very less about it and, uh, and, and there are many things, there are many questions uh, which cannot be answered uh, and, 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 and to be more precise, we are not even sure of exact reasons for having uh, a magnetic field associated uh, uh, with, with Earth, which primarily is considered uh, uh, because of the, the spin motion of Earth uh, and this spin motion of Earth give, gives rise to the magnetic field by virtue of uh, the molten metal uh, that's there present inside the core of the Earth. Uh, that, that, that's, that's assumed to be the most plausible, uh, uh, pl plausible explanation of Earth's magnetic field, but, uh, but, uh, but to